Hi everybody, welcome to this video. Thank you all for clicking that thumbnail. It means a lot if you would be just a little bit kind and leave a like for the video and a comment down below. That would mean even more thank you and that would help me a lot in you know getting the video more views etc. Oh, so I believe. Anyway, now this in this video I'm going to go to Wellsprings to meet someone called Lusum Hagar. 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 And this is the last um, Project Dagger mission that I have. Wellspring. Finally. Now let's see if we can't get a hold of Mayor Lusum Hagar. Okay, this this car doesn't look too bad. This looks more Mad Max than the one I got. The one I got really does look like Mass Effect. Looks like the, the Ranger from Mass Effect. This looks more Mad Max. Fury Road. You! Uh. You're not getting in here. Go this back to your discount rack here, in the sewers. Looks like a... To make it in this town. Ah. Just do everything you can to avoid them. Those goons are an absolute worst. All right, follow the waypoint. This looks a lot better than the last place. What was this called? Gun barrel. Don't tell me you have to say threats as me. Stop right there. I'm looking for the mayor of Wellspring. <laughs> now you're in the right place, but at the wrong time. Mayor Hagar and her staff are in lockdown. Whatever your business, you can wait. Try another day, or don't try at all. Why? Has something happened? Nope. I aim to keep it that way. Nobody gets in, nobody gets out. The mayor has bigger problems than you, Sideshow. Now, as I said... You hear that? The mayor is really lucky to have him as a bodyguard. You think you can catch a bullet, too? Lusum Hagar, mayor of Wellspring. Used to be a wingstick whiz kid. Nowadays, backs it up with a pistol. Instrumental to the Dagger Project. Whoa, 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 whoa! Easy. I'm here about the Dagger Project. Huh. Just a very exclusive list knows about that project. And you're not on it. Prowley sent me. Prowley, huh? Prowley's dead. Vineland was raised to the ground. She's a hologram. I can't explain. I'm Walker, the last of the Vineland Rangers. God damn it. More of these assholes! Ranger, let's take these fuckers out. Then we'll talk. What's the ah, great. Down there? Same. They gunned down your people, I gunned down them. Maybe you will prove useful to me after all. Ah! Oh! You're pretty damn skilled, stranger. Sure you're oh! I'm just getting warmed up, ma'am. Kill, I grant you. 
<laughs> These goons are thoroughly dead. What I expect from your boxed-in little compound. You're different. You ready to talk now? Yeah. Let's talk. You want to tell me what's going on here? Dagger was designed to stop the authority once and for all. Plans fell by the wayside when Vineland cut ties with us. I'm more than willing to reboot the project. But as you can see, I have more pressing matters. I can see that. Who are these guys? Tired thugs. The Goon Squad. Small-time bandit outfit. Who sent them? Only one scumbag with balls enough to pull a stunt like this. Clegg Clayton. Richest asshole in town. He's been eyeing the mayor's seat for a while, but lately he's been upping his game. Using bribed officials, he's laid claim to all of the city's military hardware, including the vital parts needed for Dagger. So I kill him and take back the hardware? No deal. We gotta proceed with some caution here. First, I wanna know where he gets his backing from. Second, we need to find out where he keeps all of that property. You got a plan? He's got an ego the size of an ecopod, but we can use that. If you get close to him, pay him lip service, get his trust. Then you can easily plant this gizmo on his computer. It'll let me download all of his juicy data, who's backing him, who's supplying the goon squad, and where he keeps the seized supplies. Clegg Clayton likes to surround himself with the rich and famous. They hang out at his so-called winner's lounge. You figure out a way to get in there. And you're well on your way to getting that gizmo planted. Okay, I'm on it. Excellent. Grab the gizmo. Get into Clegg's office and stick it on his computer. Where's the gizmo? Ah. Okay, let's go over to the winner's lounge. See, when she said Goon Squad, is that their actual name or is there something she calls them? Because if you're going to make, like, a gang, why would you call it Goon Squad? This is Clegg Clayton's Winner's Lounge. You're no winner, you're a loser, so get lost. Forget it. You ain't got the juice to get past the rope. Let me in. I'm a ranger. I don't give a fuck. No one gets in here who isn't rich or famous. You're neither. Come on, there's gotta be a way. Sure. You can get in by winning. Winning how? Win at Mutant Bash TV and win the Chaz Car Derby. Become a champ. Easy peasy for someone as tough as you, right? That all? Yep. You make yourself a champ, you can just waltz on in and meet the man himself. There's no other way? Not for you. Alright. So... I got a... Kill box, meat grinder, and then... What's this one? Wait. No, I need the... What's, what's this one? Go box, me grinder. What does that mean? Ah, yes, Mutant Bash TV. And what's this one? Jazz Card Derby. I'll go for the Mutant Bash first. Any luck? You get past that Boundzilla at the door? There's a way in. I've got to go kill the shit out of some muties on TV and grind some metal in the racing circuit. Become a champ. Should be a breeze. Uh, oh, let's hope you've got what it takes. Those shows eat up folks like gobbling down peanuts. I'm adjusting the range on this. I suggest looking for more modification material. Yeah, thanks. I suggest looking for more modification material. All right, right next gun barrels, right next to this mutant bash TV place. So not that long of a drive, thankfully.
there it is. The ugliest place in I'm entering the Mutant Bash TV arena. Keep an eye on your TV screen, because it's time to crack some muty skulls. I know you can, and I know you will. But be careful. Those things are nastier than you think. Alright. I held him down. <laughs> oh, mes amis, look here. What a dashing rogue the city has sent our way this evening. You, yes, you, stranger. Have you come to join us? Say it is so. Say you've wandered here from off the dark city streets and into this uh, boudoir of pleasure to join our little game. Because you have a hunger in your eyes. Tell. <laughs> Do tell me. Is it a hunger? For the promises of the flesh, I present you with hmm? a thirst, perhaps, for the reddest. Oh, yes, of wines. <laughs> or maybe the insatiable hunger of the true connoisseur, the lust to kill. <laughs> you have it. The promise of greatness. Allow us to sate your hunger for the kill, handsome. And sign here on the line. And now. Oh, sweet young thing, your journey to stardom shall commence. Kill! <laughs> Kill for Desdemonia! <laughs> okay, that woman seriously freaks me out. Where am I going? Over here. Ah. Should probably have bought ammo before doing this. Um. Actually, no, I take it back. All these people are freaking me out. Mutant Bash TV. And now, mes amis, for our next contender. Such a quiz, such a player, so devil hair. I give you a big cockroach, meaty mash of Oh shit, look out for the next wave.
That wasn't so bad. I was expecting a lot worse. Especially in, like, this game, when it comes to confined spaces, tends to be a bit more difficult than just the open area. But that was alright. Um, let me check my guns for a sec. I'm curious if I got enough felt try to upgrade one of them. Yeah. <laughs> just just over. Oh wow. Magazine capacity. I need five hundred for the next one. Good lord. Bar room lit. Continue on. Almost on to chapter three, or oh, well, whatever it is. Area three, stage three. I get the feeling I can break that, but I can't. I should be able to. Gorilla? Here come the 
All <laughs> right. This is easy. Got one more left. Ah, uh, okay. Those explosive ones really annoying. Uh, ugh. Is that it? Uh, of course it wasn't. I'm dead. Oh, Walker, Walker, you're dancing on a slack tightrope! I'm burning! Action! Ha ha, yeah! I got 1,435 tokens for the moment. Ah! And the moment I sort of oh, am aware. Goodness. Let me pop the cork and shake the bottles. Walker, you are a winner! Do come in and accept your prize. Yeah, it's a case of like the moment I'm aware that those creatures are on fire and they explode, they, they stop showing up. The moment I'm just like, right, I'm ready for them now. They just stop appearing. Uh, let's go claim my reward. Kind of worried what this is going to be. That was that. That wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Whew, you weren't kidding. You really kicked the shit out of those muties. Good job. That kind of quality slaughtering could make a star. I still gotta get behind the wheel at Chaz Car Derby, though. I know it's a habit. But hey, well spring thanks you for jumping through all these hoops. No skin off my back. As long as you come through on your end, Mayor. You won't regret this. Step on up, killer. What you looking for? Something crazy? Dizzy D loves to get you anything. Just bring me those blood so bash tokens and I'll set you up. Okay, got it. What kind of stuff you got? Bash supplies and mayhem inducing murder apparatuses, of course. And I can get your guns some nice paint jobs as well if your token pouch is overflowing. Have a pass to the max. Uh huh. Hey, I got um. I can upgrade my guns now. I can upgrade the well, rifle. No, I can't. Can I? Oh, can I? I'm not 100 percent sure. I think I need felt try to unlock the tears, and then is the weapon core mod. 
Yeah, I think that's how it works. When am I going to unlock some of these then? The Dank Catacombs. So basically the gun the game gives me the basic guns, the rifle, the shotgun, and the pistol. And uh, I have to find all the others on my own. I, I might, I might not. I am curious to see whether or not I can just get through the game with the base weapons. I have a feeling the game doesn't really doesn't really require me to do a lot of the side stuff. Just peculiar for a game. I mean, surely if you're going to put a bunch of side stuff into a game, you you should make it somewhat compulsory, or somewhat you know it'll give you like a noticeable advantage. But then again, I am playing it on normal, so it might help more and hard to do all the side stuff. I don't know. Car Derby it is. Keep your eyes on the screen. I'm gonna win this. Good luck, Walker. With those psychos you'll be racing, you're gonna need it. Well, god damn. God damn! Look what the bon ton rolled in. You here to bet your ass in the race for Chaz? Tell me it's so old Nicky Rain. Tell me you sent this wasteland you to race like a stick of butter on a pile of pancakes. After you, hot sauce. Racing, baby. I can see you got the grit to be great. You got the meat it takes to take the plate. And you got all the trimmings, too. Got a contract right here, Prime Cut. <laughs> you sign that? Well, you sign in blood. Ah. <laughs> oh. You race your way to the top crust like a knife through sirloin, and you emerge victorious and take the gravy too. <laughs> when do I start? Scritch scratch. We got your John H, and we good to go. <laughs> oh. Yeah, well, you start at the bottom, fresh meat. Get the pity bucket. You prove your sizzle in that slow-mo ride. And then move on up. Simmer to the very top like the slickest grease in a gumbo. <laughs> Go grab your ride when ready, huh? You shall be into the ground, vile creature! They barely have running water. They don't have running water, I'll be honest, they don't. But they do have contracts in the post-apocalypse still. Stand aside, peasants, and awe at the might of my golden rod! Ah, I'm it. What place with the main? I'm in seven. Good fight, sir. 
stop going so fast. Playing this on a headset is kind of fun. So I can hear which side the, the vehicles are coming up on me. Okay, right now, there's one right on my, like, towards my right side. Miss Lady Gumball Deuce Papi Swift Dag Satan Kill Mister Stick O Two and Only Mega What the Okay Yeah I'm not retrying that race. Return to Paddock. Vehicle upgrades Auto parts are used uh, okay. That means some extra special treats for you. You get to go and enjoy the ball tom at the Winter Lounge of Wellspring. Yeah, all the gravy you can gobble. And you got your free access to all of my tasty tracks, too, Prime Rip. <laughs> Drivers like you are rarer than skin on a skull hound. Do come back anytime. Mayor Lusum, I've got it. A free pass to the Winner's Lounge. I saw it all on the vid screen. Guess you really are the shit. <laughs> that was some grade-A sportsmanship. What can I say? It's how I roll. I'm on my way there now. I just realized that that guy's got a sausage on his hat. What the fuck? Anyway, um... Yeah, that's pretty much it, I think, for this video. Thank you all for watching. In the next video, I'm gonna be... I'll be already in... Already, uh, I'll already be in Wellspring, so I can just start to carry on to, like the mission from where uh, can't even get my words out today from uh, wherever I left off. So I can't even get the objective. Up. There you go. Enter the winners' lounge. So I'll be right by the winners' lounge in the next video. Thank you all for watching. It means a lot. If you've gotten to this far in the video, if you've gotten to this point, then God bless you. Uh, thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. If you could just leave a like and a comment down below, that would help a lot. Thank you. And that's pretty much it. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I hope uh, my commentary's been okay and you've enjoyed that. And I hope you have a good day. See you next time.